Welcome to the Bentley Systems training course where you will learn how to create the Eigen Solution load case in the RAM frame analysis mode. Now before we do that, let's go ahead and discuss why this might be beneficial for our model. Now as you can see, when we generated our static seismic loads, we asked the program to go ahead and calculate the period of the structure for us. Now RAM frame can calculate your structural periods in modes using one of three methods. They would be the subspace iteration method, the eigenvalue solution, or the Ritz vector method. The subspace iteration solution is the default choice by the program. This solution will calculate the natural modes of your structure and frequencies of an undamped free vibration system. These natural modes and frequencies are the exact modes and frequencies, and they provide excellent information about the dynamic characteristics of your system. Now the eigenvalue solution also calculates the exact natural modes and frequencies, and it's much faster than the other two solutions and consumes significantly less memory. For large models, we do recommend creating an eigenvalue solution when asking the program to calculate the periods and modes of your structure, even if you're not performing a dynamic analysis. Now the last solution that's available is the Ritz vector method, and this is a pro an approximate solution to eigenvectors, but it does provide results that are the same or nearly the same as the eigenvectors if enough number of Ritz vectors are included. Now for our particular model, we are gonna go ahead and create the eigen solution load case. To do that, go to your main menu, select loads, followed by load cases. Here we're gonna select the radio button for dynamic, and then we're going to create our label. In the pull down menu, we will select the Eigen Solution, click the add button, and then you can enter the number of periods requested. I will keep all of the default values, click OK, and then click OK again. Now at this point, I have finished creating my Eigen Solution load case, and I am ready to perform my analysis. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.